Good morning and welcome again to the Echo Backyard Farm. Now, the season is uh, changing from really hot summer to really rainy, rainy season. So, yeah. with the rain, we have strong winds. So, we need to tie up this one because it fell down because of the strong winds and of course because it has a lot of roots and yeah. it's too heavy has some heavy fruits here may yeah. see at the moment let's take a look a close by yes look at that no we should really harvest this yeah yeah oh. and there's a lot of ants yeah ants there are lots of ants because they come out when it is wet yeah when the soil becomes wet they don't like to stay in the soil yeah. and they come out and then so better to they come to this. torment you yeah. <laughs> I can take this out because it's too heavy. Yes. Yeah, and already nice. Yeah. Already good to. Oh. Oh. <laughs> my ants are biting my feet. Yeah, I can do that for yeah. you. I'll do it later. I'm just going to. Oh, uh... <laughs> <laughs> kawawa, na man. Yeah. And uh, aside from doing that. Yes. We opted to uh, take out the sugar cane. Yeah. Because uh, of the strong it's, wind. It's, it's blowing over, huh? Yeah, it's already down. Yes. Oy, oy. It's a pity because it's really big. Yeah. So if you want to continue. Maybe you should bring it to do. Batangas. <laughs> yeah. To have the sugar. But Extracted. The thing, but the thing with uh, when you're dealing with uh, sugar. sugar cane, the leaves. Are razor sharp, you can see. Yes, uh, and then they have little it will, teeth on it. It will cut you. Yes, so you need to. You know that because you were in Kalatagan before, yeah. and they had all a lot of when sugar we cane still, there. Yeah, when we were still kids, we would. Uh, I know it's bad, but we were still small kids, we would steal. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, sugar you, cane. you never told your pa, <laughs> and actually, here. That here's the, the, the proof. Well, we were stealing sugar cane. You can see my keloid. Yes, you yes. You know how that happened? Uh, how did that happen? So I was, uh, we were stealing sugar cane. And one of my friends shout out loud saying that the owner is coming, the owner is coming. So I, uh, the, 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 the machete that we were, that I was yielding was so sharp. It went through the sugar cane like butter and straight to my foot. Oh, that's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> so you were trying to to mix the two. So after that, I learned. <laughs> <laughs> so you know already how to use a machete. And not to steal sugar cane. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can only get it. So you're getting it from the flood now. Yeah, it's a pity. How yes, but you will have to really uproot that if you don't want that to come to grow back again. See how big it is? Yes, it's a... Yeah, yeah it's taller than you, of course. I'm just going to cut it here. Yes. So we can still suck from this part. Better put my foot away. Yeah, because you have a good a good bolo also. Eh? Yeah, this one is also sharp. Mm. See, and the uh, outside is also sharp. Yeah, it's a pity. Well, anyway. Yeah. Well, it's becoming a. Yeah, it's it's becoming a nuisance. A nuisance yes. and uh, a hindrance to what we're doing. So yeah, might as well take it out. If you want to grow sugar cane, you better grow a whole field. Yeah, a whole big field. Uh, you, you, <laughs> you cannot do much with it's it. Going to engulf everything. Okay. What you doing there? <laughs> I'm weeding the spinach. You see, we, we have been growing them a little bit in grooves like that, and what would you call that? Trenches. Trenches, yeah. So that it's easy to hurt them up a bit. Yeah, the same way we planted our uh, white radish before, as yeah. we've shown in the past 
It's a little bit wet from the beginning because it got wet from the rain there. Yeah, it, it's raining every day now. Yeah. So it's like uh, an abrupt transition yeah, from really wet. hot. When it's wet, the, the leaves will come muddy. Yeah. And then like that. What are you doing there, Ma? Yeah, we have to cut this two grasses. Same as waiting also because the once you once the grasses are already high, it will cover our newly planted papaya. Yeah. That that will hinder the growth of the papaya. Yeah. So, so we planted the uh, papaya here. Actually, we planted uh, a few papayas. I'm going to show you where we planted it. It's just beside the fence, so we can just tie it up to the fence when it. The winds get too strong so that was one two and we also installed a drip system there well it's we're not going to use it now because it's raining all the time another one there another one there and the last one is over here all right what are you doing there Sugar cane. Oi, it's cold, Yeah. <laughs> don't don't swallow this. <laughs> yes. Yeah. If you really want a fibrous uh, diet. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. Oh, what happened? Your tooth is gone. It's in between my teeth. Oh, that's good. But anyway, so instead of uh, because we we got a lot from the sugar cane. So instead of uh, bringing it to Batangas, bring it to Batangas <laughs> to extract uh, sugar, uh, what I did was to chop it up and split it in the middle. What we're going to do with this is, if you follow me, we ferment it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mind you, this is funky. Mm, and it smells good, you know. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, those are mosquito quan. Mm -hmm. Mosquito, that's not so good. But if we drain it, they're going to go away. Yeah, but. So what we're going to do now? It's going to overflow yeah. a bit. Yeah, but that will not be so nice if it overflows then. But I think not really. No, no. No, no, it's doing all right. Oh. I don't have to tie a stone to it. Yeah, yeah it goes down. It's heavy. It's heavy, heavy enough. stuff. So, mm. this is our uh, fermenting battle. And yes, barrel. Believe us when we tell you it's really funky. <laughs> it smells good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. it smells so good. Yeah, funky. It smells like when you pass in the fields in Flanders when they have just yeah. been throwing around all the dung of the cows yeah. on the field mm. and, uh, <laughs> if you know if you want to know more what we put in it how to administer it to your plants you can always purchase our materials all right, right. okay you're still weeding there wow We have a little bit of fungus on our pepino, or what do you call that? Cucumber. Because it has been wet, it has been hot, hot weather when we planted this. It was really very hot. Sometimes it was even 38 degrees here in Silang. Yeah, 38, 39. Yeah, imagine that in Silang. And now, all at once, there are the rains, it's cooler, it's windy. Well, you would be happy, happy that it's a little bit windy, but in the beginning it was not. It became very wet, and so. Kunjai came in. Yeah. See? They came in and they I know, are attacking the these. plants. Yeah. There's a little, that's an egg probably of a leaf miner. Let me focus on it. <coughs> that's a, that yellow thing, it's a leaf miner egg. Yeah. And those are leaf miners under there, see? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They make tunnels inside the. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, uh, this plant has already been giving 
like some fruits. Yeah, and we and don't we don't plant this plant for the leaves, for the leaves but <laughs> for the fruits, and they are doing all right yeah. still. So we are all right. we are letting it live all its life. So that will be our last harvest probably, and then well we have other yeah we have uh, there cucumber waiting. And that's the there's, youngest batch. Yeah, over there's there. another one there. The yeah, no, so, the other side. So there will be somehow some kind of continuity. Yeah. Uh, it happens, it's how nature balances itself. Yeah, yes, it's so well. Yeah. Okay. There are still big ones here, Tan. Yeah, we still yeah, need to harvest here. it. Look, this yeah. one here. One, yeah. two. Yeah, we still there, are there are several. Yeah. Yeah. There are still several yeah, here just, that's going to develop into just, bigger yeah. ones. Yeah, I just harvested some 10 cucumbers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to take out all the big ones so yeah. it will not take a lot of uh, energy from the plant to make the sm other small ones yeah. become big. All right. So uh, it's time uh, to feed our fish. These are homemade, first of all, homegrown bananas that we cooked and ground into pellets and we dried. Yep. So we're going to feed this to our fish. And aside from this one, we also have duckweed. Actually, duckweed is already uh, a complete meal for your uh, fish it's very high in protein that makes them grow big oh, by the way two days ago i harvested the duck with more or less half of it yeah no it's already full again yeah. before uh we we told you not to harvest more than 25 percent but we that's what we do here in the echo backyard farm we try out things so mm. <laughs> papa harvested half of it yeah. and now because yeah because because i observed that since the weather is a bit cooler now they grow better. Yeah. They grow faster. Faster. So I think it was too hot for the poor little one cell or one another cell or one leaf duckweeds. Yeah, and you can see what the duckweed did to the water. It's very clear now. Yeah, because if you look at former videos of ours where there was no duckweed yet, you could see the water was very green. Green and dirty. Yes, and now it's very clean. Yeah, they feed on that dirt, so. Yes, that's why we have to add some dirt. <laughs> so yeah. they will have enough food. See, and we have also duckweed here, yeah. see? Look at the fish here. Ooh, yes. They like it. Mm. I like a chiquita banana. But they're a little bit yeah, uh, very, very from of people, you know? They, yeah. Chiquita banana, come on, eat chiquita banana. <laughs> Don't be scared. We're not going to bite you yet. <laughs> yes, yes, the chops are, yes. Mm, yummy. I hope you can see it well with, with the camera. Yep. Oop. Yes. What are these guys doing inside here? Because, would you like to monkey bum bum? Yes, I'm going to honk your nose. Honky, bonky, 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 bonky. <laughs> <laughs> honk your nose. <laughs> Chokito, Baby Blue Shade. Hey, do you like that? Honk your nose, eh? You're so strong. Yeah, you like that. Oh yes. Oh yes. That's the thing that makes you uh, stop whining and oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to monkey bone? Ah, ta ta ta. 